Hello and today we will be checking how uh, the marketplace admin can allow the buyers to add more than one seller's product to their cart and uh, while a particular seller's products are in the cart and are being processed for the checkout the remaining products will remain in the cart so that the payment can be made immediately or later as per the buyer's convenience. So. Uh, We'll be checking the workflow of the same at the customer's end and the rest of the configurations as well. And uh, can you note that this plugin, that's the WordPress WooCommerce Marketplace Split Cart plugin, is an add on to the WordPress WooCommerce Multi Vendor Marketplace module by Webpool. So you'll have to have that first, and then you can make use of the WooCommerce Multi Vendor Marketplace Split Cart plugin feature within your store. So right now I can see that I'm at the storefront and uh, let's log into the customer account and I've added here two product, one is of the admin and one is of the uh, marketplace vendor there. So uh, let me go ahead and let me log into the customer account first and then I'll be showing you the workflow of this uh, plugin. So you can see that I've uh, logged into the customer account and now the customers can add the products from multiple sellers uh, into their cart and uh, after adding if i tap here on the view cart button that brings up the cart button and here you can see that each of the products uh, having their respective if the the products are of different uh, vendors there then all of them would be uh, like uh, listed differently so here the seller is webpool having the product uh, happy ninja and here you can see that it's of the admin and if i scroll down here you can see the seller as John Doe, the marketplace vendor, having the Happy Ninja with the name seller there. Now uh, you might have missed this. Here we have the card portals for the seller Webcool and the proceed to checkout button for the same. And the other seller, his card total and the proceed to checkout button. Now uh, let's proceed further and let's uh, see how this uh, WooCommerce marketplace split card works. So you've seen that the cart has been split for each of the respective seller's products. So one by one, we can make a checkout now. So uh, let's check out the admin's product first. So I'll just tap here in the proceed to checkout button. And now we can proceed further uh, with the admin's product. So I'll just place the order. Now after placing the order, when I go back to my cart, you can see still one uh, item is pending there. That's uh, from the other seller there. So as soon as we place the order here, all right the order has been received okay and here a uh, message is also shown to the customer that some products are still waiting in the cart and they can directly go to the cart uh, by tapping here on the go to cart or they can manually go there directly so i'll just tap here on the cart itself and this is the other product of the seller john doe and now we can make a checkout with him as well so let's tap here on the proceed to checkout now this is the product of the other seller, that's uh, the John Doe. And now let's place the order. So that's how the uh, customer just needs to add multiple seller products into the cart. Then this cart is split based upon the multiple sellers here and each uh, will have to be checked out uh, one by one. So if, a, if there are uh, two products from two different sellers, then you'll have to check out one by one by first going for the first seller, then for the second seller. We have the proceed to check out for each of those uh, multiple products having multiple sellers there. And that's how this particular plugin, uh, that's the WooCommerce Multimedia Marketplace Pit Cut by Webcool works. So uh, that was it about the uh, plugin and I hope it helped you out in understanding how it works. So just uh, to give you one more example here, let me add a few products to the cart uh, from the catalog page here and uh, let me go to the cart itself so let's see if the cart has been split seller john doe cart totals we have a different proceed to checkout button seller webcool his products and a proceed to checkout button for the same so uh, that was much about the plugin itself and if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements kindly do reach back to us at support at veritofwebcool.com raise a ticket at webcool.uvs.com you can also contact us through https colon forward slash forward slash www.webcool.com forward slash contacts. Apart from that, if you find this particular video helpful, then kindly do give it a thumbs up. Also, do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest 
updates from our end. And lastly, thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead.